Jessina is a, is a French REIT, so the largest French REIT in the office sector, and we announced at this MIPIM the signing of a forward sale, forward purchase actually, we've done in the city of Lyon. So uh, it might be surprising for an expert of the city of Paris to buy in Lyon, but in fact the truth is that Jessina has been a long-term player in what is what we consider as the second largest mar office market of France. But after Paris, the, the largest market is Lyon. And we are purchasing, uh, taking a, a letting risk, uh, a big building, 30,000 square meter, to be built in the heart of Lyon Pardieu, which is the, the heart of the city of Lyon, just connected to the uh, railway station where the TGV is arriving and going. And so we purchased that building from a famous French developer, and uh, he will build for us a state-of-the-art building, which what, what is the, uh, the DNA of Jessina is to build iconic buildings uh, f su f suiting well for tenants and we, we believe strongly in this market. We bought it with a, 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 a yield which will be our cost yield of 7%. So I consider that we bought uh, a, yield, a yield premium for the risk we take, the letting risk we take. But I am absolutely confident that at any other building we've done in Lyon in the past will be pre-let before 2018, which is the date of delivery. 2014 uh, is a year transition for the, the Paris office market. Jessina is a specialist of the office market, so I will talk about that. We are the leader in the, uh, in the office market of Paris, which is, I just always remember that, the largest market of Europe in terms of office. We're talking about 55 million square meters, and we are the first market in terms of take-up uh, with 2.2 million square meters which were rented last year. We are the largest European city, I'm afraid, including London. Uh, and uh, so we are very confident on this market. And clearly, and I think now the international market is acknowledging that the market is slowly but certainly getting out of a letting crisis which has been in place for six years. Started probably in, in 2009, as always, France takes more time probably compared to England to acknowledge that we are in a crisis, but we, we manage to get out of it also sometimes. It's happening now. 2014 was a transition year with stabilization of rent, with the start of the rise of the take-up, and now 2015 is really showing the first signs of the real recovery. So we are in this market. We are more than happy to take some risk, letting risk, both by buying buildings, both by exposing our own portfolio, creating value and repositioning our buildings. Clearly the, uh, the DNA of Jessina is, is the office, but the office of tomorrow, I would say. So we are, uh, we are dedicated to iconic buildings with an extremely well, lo extremely well located, with an, uh, an outstanding transport system always close to the building. And we try to have buildings different from the others. Uh, what we call in, fr in French les immeubles remarquables, uh, we, meaning that we try to have buildings different from the one of our competitors by the location, by the ar architectural approach, by the, the, the range of service we try to give in the building and trying to anticipate what the tenants of tomorrow will like to, to find in their building. So obviously this goes through a uh, CSR approach. We, we want buildings not only greener than greener, but we want them, uh, we want them comfortable, we want them well-being inside, we want our tenants to be uh, uh, interested in staying in our, in our buildings and, and developing a partnership with, with us. So we are a huge owner, we have a concentration on office, we can propose to our tenants mutualization uh, of the services between the different buildings, which is something that could be interesting. Just for instance, a tenant not having a meeting room or a boardroom or a company restaurant can use the, 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 uh, the amenities of the, of the neighbor, which is also our building. So uh, this is a way also to, uh, to manage to, to create a specific relationship with a tenant.